purity. When you land on an alien planet and think, man, things were really better back home. So, you pursue the purity affinity with the goal of reshaping the planet in the image of your dear old mum. You bushwhack through bugs, clear out miasma, and give your sieve a kind of art deco, golden age revival sort of aesthetic. Classy. But what does it take to go all the way Earth, and how are you going to convince others who might not be on board with your plans? To earn the Promised Land victory, you start in the same place as the Emancipation victory by researching orbital networks and launching a laser comm satellite to get in touch with the gang back on Earth. Launch it over your scienciest city to use the 15% science boost to speed you on your way to nanotechnology, which not only lets you construct an exodus gate, but also gets you closer to the ultimate purity unit, the Lev Destroyer. More on that one in a sec. The Exodus Gate is a wonder that you have to spend production to build and also plunk down on an actual tile in your territory. Close to your capital would be good, so you can bombard anyone who comes to try to knock it down, and even better if you place it near your magrail lines. Or just like, build some magrail lines near it, radiating out away from your cities. It seems weird, I know, but the whole point of this thing is to bring folks over from Earth and settle them on the new planet, and you can't put them in settlements within three hexes of a city, an outpost, or a station. Once the gate is complete, you can summon one settler per turn, and you gotta shepherd these scared little newbies to settlements and plunk them down. You're gonna need four spots in total, because each settlement can only accommodate six settlers, and you need a total of 20 to win. Hopefully you've got some room nearby, but you may have to evict some old tenants if space becomes a problem. Fortunately, stations go down easy, but if other civs start getting real mad about the promised land drawing closer, the Lev Destroyer is the perfect conflict negotiation tool. It can travel anywhere but mountains and bombard within two hexes, though it takes a turn to set up like most siege weapons. But once it's set up... Ba -ba 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 boom The cleansing fire rains down upon thine enemies and their sins and cities are washed away. Then it's just a matter of getting your settlements set up, packing them full of earthlings, and behold, this planet truly has become the promised land. Praise be!